right turn. A Broadway star. Lisa Gibbons has a special cover story report. Her name is Madonna, but just who is that girl? In four and a half years, her image has gone from the brassy newcomer who made underwear fashionable to a glamorous hybrid of Marilyn Monroe and Jean Harlow. I guess this is what they mean by making a spectacle of yourself. To her latest look of sophistication unveiled in this month's Harper's Bazaar. But while the look may change, the true essence of Madonna remains. It's a combination of talent and drive that was evidenced as far back as 1984 when we first interviewed her after her first hit, Holiday. I'm out to do something and I'm going to do it. I have to get there. And I think I have a lot of confidence in myself, so I think that's part of it. Her follow-up album, Like a Virgin, sold 7 million copies worldwide and proved her success wasn't a fluke. The hits continued, and this material girl seemed to be under a lucky star that transferred into big box office at concert arenas. And eventually, a career on the big screen. Susan! What are you doing here? I got good news and bad news. What do you want to hear first? You said you were going to leave. Okay, good news first. Your wife isn't partners with the grease ball. Desperately Seeking Susan brought critical acclaim to the pop star, and while she followed it up with two box office bombs, Shanghai Surprise with husband Sean Penn, and Who's That Girl, she had established herself as a legitimate actress. If you think conquering the concert stage, the music charts, and the silver screen would be enough, not for Madonna, not while there is still this, Broadway. Madonna is now hitting the Broadway stage in Speed the Plow by Pulitzer Prize winning playwright David Mamet. In an unglamorous secondary role opposite Tony winner Joe Montagna and Ron Silver, Madonna rehearsed for six weeks to prove to herself and to the critics that she is a serious actress. I'm frightened. I know that you are. I would have come here anyway. Is that depraved? I know what it is to be bad. I've been bad. The play has become the hot ticket on Broadway, drawing fans and celebrities to the four weeks of previews. She really challenged herself, and I think she should be proud. More stars and excitement are expected tonight at the play's premiere. And with her performance, this 29-year-old superstar hopes to add one more accolade to an already long list of career achievements. Lisa Gibbons, Entertainment Tonight. And tomorrow on Entertainment Tonight, you'll have one of the best seats in the house for Madonna's premiere. We'll wrap up all the action from the stage to the stars in the audience.